Vision 38, 5 January 2023 This part I didn't draw, but it started with the same red virus, just like the 26th of December 2022. There was more viruses on top of each other, like it was multiplying. God is warning us just that there will be more viruses and pestilence. By picture number one, after a while everything changed into the abyss, I saw a white misty form going into the pit. By picture number two, then God showed me the next vision. The outside and the inside of the abyss started to shine brightly. Only the pit where the locusts came out was pitch black. This event will be spiritual. Then the fifth angel blew his trumpet, and I saw a star that had fallen to earth from the sky, and he was given the key to the shaft of the bottomless pit. When he opened it, smoke poured out as though from a huge furnace, and the sunlight and air turned dark from the smoke. Then locusts came from the smoke and descended on the earth, and they were given power to sting like scorpions. They were told not to harm the grass or plants or trees, but only the people who did not have the seal of God on their foreheads. They were told not to kill them, but to torture them for five months with pain, like the pain of a scorpion sting. In those days, people will seek death, but will not find it. They will long to die, but death will flee from them. The locusts looked like horses, prepared for battle. They had what looked like gold crowns on their heads, and their faces looked like human faces. They had hair like women's hair, and teeth like the teeth of lion. They wore armor made of iron, and their wings roared like an army of chariots rushing into battle. They had tails that stung like scorpions, and for five months they had the power to torment people. Their king is an angel from the bottomless pit. His name in Hebrew is Abaddon, and in Greek, Apollyon, the destroyer. The first terror is past, but look, two more terrors are coming. By picture number three, the next vision was a strange looking dark tunnel with clouds in the sky. It was like I was being taken somewhere. By picture number four, it took me under the water. It was very deep. In front of me, I could see the star. It was moving to the dark, deep ocean. It's very dark and claustrophobic. Then everything went red. I could still see through the red water. I saw the heavy iron door with sharp studs. God is showing me the door where the angels are locked up under the Euphrates River. By picture number five, then I saw hell. So clearly the edges were glowing hot and right in the middle. Deep underneath was the hot flames of hell. I was shocked to see this, but people were jumping into the fire as if by free will.